well let's start doing this so previously i have done this math and i have recorded it but unfortunately the voice was not recorded so i have to make the video again so i will try to reconstruct the idea and we'll try to make it easier and break it down to you okay so let's start it so we're starting so let us uh, start by reading the reading the question so consider the system shown in the figure if a change of 0.9 kilopascal in the pressure of air causes the brine mercury interface in the right column to drop by 5 millimeter in the brine level in the right column while the pressure in the brine pipe remains constant determine the ratio of a2 by a1 okay so the a2 a2 is here and the a1 is here uh, this one and this one so okay so let's uh, break down the question so here uh, here are two situation before and after so before uh, the brine gets down to 5 millimeter and after it gets down to the 5 millimeter so these are two scenario or these are two case scenarios and for these two case scenarios uh, we have to write down the equations two equations so i have started from the air so the pressure of air a1 plus rho of w this gh then plus rho of hg mercury gh hg1 minus h as we are going upward over here so hbr1 rho hbr sorry rho br and g equals to pbr1 okay okay so this is our equation one and then the equation two after after it has reached each reach story it has dropped five millimeter so the equation will be similar but uh, the changes let's see p of a1 okay plus for water we'll get hw rho w g okay the next for the mercury we'll get rho the rho will be same the g will be same the change will be in the height so we'll gonna determine or we'll gonna write it as 2 okay h2 h1 and then h2 okay so then again for this we'll gonna get minus hbr2 rho br g equals to pbr2 okay so before and after now what we'll have to do is that we have to subtract this equation from this so means 1 minus 2 why because uh, there is written that if a change of 0 0.9 kilo pascal in the pressure of air so air pressure difference so to get the air pressure difference means pa1 minus pa2 we have to subtract this so we're gonna do the subtraction over here we're gonna subtract and then uh, just think that it is a plus then i'm gonna explain why it, it turned into minus okay so it is plus plus then okay so while i am doing subtraction the signs will be changed or altered so this is this will be minus two so then i have written this line okay we will gonna if you think that uh, if you do simple calculations then you will gonna get this line okay so you will gonna get this line okay? okay so after getting this line let's go over here then as i have uh, said or saying that uh, as this is just uh, this brine pipe pressure or the fluid has just dropped five millimeter so i am taking this side as plus positive and as this is drowning and dropping then this side will get upper side right so i am getting the direction negative so from this i have just changed the signs so this is brine side so i have done the brine side positive and it remain positive and uh, as it is going upward so this side i have taken negative and it has turned into negative okay so why this turns into i mean pb1 minus pb2 equals to zero why okay so this is because that the pressure remains constant okay so the pressure remains constant so as the pressure remains constant that means that uh, it will be zero right the pressure constant it means as before it was 5 then it will be 5 and after 5 minutes it is 5 so 5 minus 5 it will be 0 so this is the thing okay 
so okay after that let's move forward okay so then i have just uh, just wrote the values this is the value then secondly these are the values these are the values okay so where will be the change the change will be in this phase so h total and this one right okay so i have written h total okay so uh, for the reason of written h total uh, it's because that okay so this is the difference of mercury right so mercury height difference and this is the difference of height difference in the brine side so in the brine side i know the difference i know the difference is 0 uh, 0 0.05 meter or 5 millimeter okay so uh, this is 5 millimeter and in the uh, in the side of the you know uh, in the side of the mercury this is i have written as total pi total so why i have written as total because the actual change is happening in the mercury side right so the mercury is dropping this side 5 millimeter and it is also increasing this side 5 millimeter so not not actually 5 millimeter uh, because we don't know because we don't know the height because or the height also also changes as uh, as the area is not same so the height will not same uh, will not be the same as the volume is also different so uh, as, per, as per the point uh, as per the point uh, as concerned okay so let's uh, move forward so as it is as h total so as for the h total um, i guess you have uh, guessed it well that uh, why i have written it as h total so after um, getting the h total uh, i have written uh, the difference as h total because the 5 millimeter uh, drop is also included over here okay so the actual drop is also actual or total drop will be including this 5 minute and this how much uh, here it gets so after that i have just uh, i have every mm, every value uh, except h total so i have determined h total from here so this is the h total 2.1782 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter okay so after that let's move on to the next uh, so as per the equilibrium theory as uh, as it is in the equilibrium so as it is in the equilibrium we're gonna say that we can say that v1 equals to v2 so we can change in the color so it is making it more worse okay so this one v a1 equals to v2 so v equals to a a h so a1 a2 equals to sorry a1 h1 equals to a2 h2 and then i can write a2 by a1 equals to uh, this will be h2 means brine and brine height means 5 uh, millimeter uh, will be converted into meter and divided by and uh, divided by, by the left side oh one thing i have missed by so i have determined the h total the h total is this one so h total is 7.18 okay so as i have no, i know the h total and i know the uh, left side so, uh, right side uh, right side elevation or uh, the change so i can easily get the change in the left side right so in the left side i will get the change this one so h total equals to h left plus h right and then from that i have written that h uh, left equals to this one okay okay so after that we will come over here okay so after that we're gonna come over this step and we're gonna use this over these two points and then we're gonna get the ratio after putting this one oh, on the up and this one on the and we're gonna get this one so thank you for watching and hope that you have understand it well but if you have any confusion then please ask me in the comment section thank you